up, it's Ebony, and welcome back to my channel. Today we are back playing The Sims 4, the Not So Very Challenge. I am last time we are we were still working on our ten kisses, and I believe we need one more strong romantic connection with somebody. Uh, so we're moving along pretty well in the challenge. I think our charisma skill is like level seven or eight as well. We're currently trying to take over the debate club. We're doing really good. I don't think we've lost a debate yet, which is very presidential of us. So I'm really enjoying this challenge, and I hope you guys are as well. Um, it definitely makes The Sims very exciting every day. I really just want to keep playing. So, um, so yeah, let's get right back into it. <laughs> Get your debate pants on, people. It's time for the debate guild showdown. <gasps> we have to go. Alright, let's go to the debate showdown and then let's invite our family to come and watch us. Or, yeah, let's invite our family to come and watch us. They've been asking to see us, so let's invite them and we'll invite our friends as well. So, the debate showdown. Every Saturday at sunrise, the debate guild meets for a savage battle of wits. It's a dirty and ferocious brawl of your world against mine. Only one master of convincement shall be named champion. Okay, so it's happening. Currently. Go here together. We're about to debate it up. Oh, we're about to debate. We're about to debate. Our statue's all dirty. We're about to- We've beat this girl before, we can beat her again. Everybody be quiet. Excuse me. <laughs> Augustus hates research and debate. That's funny. Yeah, we won! You lose. We're on the road to fame. Celebrities, there are many different ways to become celebrity. Killed it. So are we done? Am I done? I mean, my family all left. They're like, all right, that wasn't beautiful, honey. We're going to go now. No. Not somebody just farting. Weirdos. All right, I guess the debate's over. Let's order some food. Uh, order some cinnamon roll. Oh, my God. Girl, get back in there right now. How did he win? My whole family left to come watch TV. <laughs> so rude. We should go out tonight, so why don't you go catch up on some sleep, and then we gonna go out. And hopefully we'll meet some new guys at the nightclub that we can kiss and stuff. There's a soccer game going on, too. But we're gonna skip it this time. No, sorry, Lee. Don't wanna talk. Hey, Ruby, I fancy some soccer tea. No, I can't, Dad. I'm sorry. All right, let's just go to the karaoke bar. Let's go to the party place. Let's go ahead and... Order drinks for the group. Let's get us all whatever these things are. Let's go in right away and ask if, you're, if he's single. He's pretty attractive. He's married to Rose. Who's Rose? Who's Rose? Rosemore? Who is that? Do we care, though? Oh, he didn't like it. Alright, scratch that one, then. Kiyoshi Ito. Stop doing that. He's married. Let's go talk to him. He's so cute. <laughs> Who's singing? Girl, what? I'm hoping she'll find somebody attractive. But, I don't know. I'm hoping she will. Alright, let's give another flirt. Alright, don't talk to her. You make me feel like a man. Alright. 
Ruby got the impression that Kishi finds her quite attractive. That's good. Ah! There's an alien! He is married, but we'll pretend that we don't know. <laughs> is his wife here? All right. Uh, he has four children! Anaya Ito. She's not here, right? <laughs> we just need a kiss. And then he'll be like, actually, you know, I'm actually married. And then she'll be like, oh, okay. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Festering bitterness. <gasps> Somebody here! Is his wife here? Uh, somebody's bitter. Where? That's not her. Come on, just get the kiss and let's run! Ugh, this is the worst. That's his wife? Oh my god. She does look like an elder. Give him a romantic gift, I guess. I don't know. Give him some chips. Did he just run out? No. Alright, we'll get a kiss from him eventually. Let's do some karaoke. Oh, Autumn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine with, uh, why don't you go do a polite introduction with the alien? We can kiss the alien, I'm down for that. He's into it. Maybe we should just not ask him if they're single? I feel like it's better if we just don't know. <laughs> we have the impression that Reese finds her quite attractive. Clearly! <laughs> Xenophilia? Xenophilia? I'm dead, that's funny. Okay, we can go to home now. All right, let's go. Oh my god, Candace is doing a keg stand. She needs to chill. They got no chill. Let's go right to bed. All right, why don't we do some work? Let's get all of our... We don't have that for three days. That's 24 hours. Let's do our cultural homework. I swear it won't happen again. I'm so glad you came by. No, we don't want to be a tech career. Kiyoshi's calling me. Do you want to go out on a date? Okay, listen. He's married, right? But he's asking me out on a date. He's pretty cute. So we're going to go. <laughs> listen, I can't help it. Ruby is a serial romantic. It's just the way things are. Be like, sir, you're going to get caught by your wife. I'm tempted to like <clears throat> have him and his wife break up. You know what? You. Wait, he has how many kids? I can't believe he has four kids. Alright, I got rid of all of his relationships. I think one of our... One of my mods is making it to where I can't open the sim profile. It might be the roommate one. So that's the only one that I just downloaded. So why don't we ask about his attractive preferences? It's no nice to be with someone I can talk to for hours. He's not married anymore, guys. I cleared his relationship, so he has no wife. It was just a random wedding, anyway. Oh, no! Oh, I thought that was the alien I kissed last night. <gasps> not him being here. Okay, he didn't even pay attention, so. This looks a lot like Peaches. Oh, she has breakouts. Girl. Oh, my God. We just need one more kiss. Oh, he's sad. Not good. Okay, so I also, I just did, um, I got rid of her sedentary lifestyle because if we look at the lifestyles, this one is currently in progress. Maintain a behavior to lock, live a life immersed in technology to acquire and maintain this lifestyle, interact regularly with electronics and technology, or join a tech-related career. So, I don't know how she's getting that one, but... If we were going to get that one and that one, then we wouldn't be able to get any more. And she's not sedentary, sedentary, whatever. She was only like that when she was a teenager because she didn't like working out, so she didn't really do much. But now she's going to go for 
the workaholic one. So yeah, I deleted that. So I think we got a kiss from Kyoshi here already. And then I was also looking. And she doesn't find any of these guys attractive, right? But you click the alien. Extremely attractive. Like, girl. All right, we're going to go home now. So, see you later, Kyoshi. So, yeah. So, so far, she hasn't found anybody that she finds attractive. Let's throw on a face mask really quick as well because she's having a little bit of a problem right now. So, we're pretty much done with this. Uh, we literally just have two more sims to kiss. What? Forrest has a baby? Chime Ono? With who? Mariko Ono? Oh my god, Forrest. See what happens? I literally just stopped. I marked them as unplayed not that long ago. Why is Regina here? <laughs> Regina, go home. Hey, I got a special gift for you because you're such a good neighbor and I appreciate your kindness. I want to see what it is. What is it? What was it? Is he here? Oh, he is here. Okay, your dad just showed up in our dorm for some reason. So why don't you go talk to him? Say, hey, dad. Uh, what are you doing at the dorms? I mean, it's good to see you, but like, why would you just randomly show up? <laughs> You know, now that I'm pretty much done with what I wanted to do here, uh, I hang out for a bit. How was you, how was your day been? Oh, he came and bought her a gift. That is so cute. A postcard. Oh, that was cute. I'm really that was so cute. All right, let's go over here and let's continue. It's like the middle of the night, so why don't you just continue editing your term paper? We still only have two days left. Hopefully we get A pluses. She didn't study at all for her final, so that's a little rough, I would say, but it's okay. Ruby turned in her homework confidently. Okay. So she has the politics of leadership class in five hours. So what we're first going to do is go here. So five hours. So she has the class at three o'clock. So in the meantime, we're going to, for just a second, we're going to debate a topic. Let's debate, is homework beneficial with this guy? All right, we won once again. Okay, and then we still have one more hour. So let's research any topic it says. So go ahead and research this. Nice. Okay, go ahead and go brush your teeth. So go ahead and practice some speech. It's 2 o'clock in the morning, so we can't really kiss anybody right now. We could kiss Candace, but we're going to keep it strictly friendship. I don't know why she's sad. Nice, nice, nice. Level 8 charisma. All right, let's call that. Uh, go ahead and eat that. And then we'll go to bed. All right, go get final presentation. And then you have class five hours after that. Saw you heading out to reading. Well, Candace, we're actually going to study. We also need to find our next victim to kiss. That's also something we need to do. Why don't we practice debating until about 11:30? I lied. That's done. So then come over here and research this. We're gonna do this until 11:30, and then when we're to 11:30, we're gonna. You know, whatever. Come over here and study for Pathways of Colonization. We'll finish this stuff after our finals are done. We're also going to go out and party when our finals are done. Because that's what college kids do. So I think we did everything that we needed to do for those classes. So we are going to party. I'm going to play down like a party lot though. Ooh, go dig that really quick. Okay, so it's summer today. It's not that hot out today. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to throw a party. It's the last day of finals, so the best thing to do is throw a pool party, right? So I decided to just travel because for whatever reason I can't like plan a social event at this lot that I plan that I put. So 
a pool party paradise. Everyone will show up anyway, so it's whatever. Look how cute. That's the toddler area. But the area for the adults is over here. Let's all go here. And we'll hire a mixologist. Go here together, everybody. Cute. Okay, so a service time is coming. And then where's the music? Listen to island radio. And then, girl, why don't you... Everyone swim together. Are you doing something fun? <laughs> Everybody, let's swim it up. We're looking... Also looking at the same time we're looking for our victim. <gasps> Straight A pluses. We killed it. Wow. We literally killed it. Yes, we're going to sign up for... We only need four more classes left for our politician degree. But this time we're going to live in a university housing. And we'll pay with, should we pay household funds? Yeah. And then we're obviously gonna have Candace and Autumn move in and then we'll probably have one more roommate. I'm obviously gonna place a gallery lot as well. Jump for the group. Ooh, do a backflip. Go do it. She's gonna be like, absolutely not. Oh my god, I hope she doesn't die. Oh, wow. That was actually really good. Ah, good job, girl. Well, that was a flop. No adults came here. So, that's fail. Alright, you can go ahead and go home then. Oh yeah, that's right. Time to pack up and move out. So go ahead and sleep. I'll pack everything up. I forgot that we're moving out. So let's see here. Was that Candace? You are not Candace, ma'am. Obviously, this house is not going to work for me. So we're going to look for some in the gallery. That looks so cute from the front. Hopefully the inside's nice. I mean, I can move some stuff around if I have to. Okay, I kind of like it. This could be, this could be our room. Obviously, we'll make it red with our own bathroom. That one, we'll do that one. I don't know. Let's just do natural light, whatever. Okay, and then let's just change up Ruby's room a little bit here. Um, I might just completely change out this bed. Because we need a bed that's red. Okay, I feel like that might be good enough. Um, I'm going to remove all my roommates. They can be replaced after I'm done adding my girls. Nope, Autumn, you're staying. Alright, and then we're going to choose another roommate. We're going to choose our girl. Oh, no. Okay, so a little problem is... For whatever reason, Candace, I can't add her, so I'm just going to add some other people right now. And then we'll see if Candace shows up. Let's go ahead and put our stuff from our inventory down to make our house a little bit more. Ugh. A little bit more, you know, whatever. Coast card or dad gave us to the bay guild poster and then just our pictures of what our dad with Corey, with autumn with candace another one Corey. okay and then go ahead and go and visit the commons we'll get some food and we'll debate to raise our fun so go over here and then just practice debating for right now all right you need to research Whatever, just research, whatever. We're now a seasoned member of the debate guild. Participating in debate events now counts as extra credit for communications, history, language, psychology, and economics. Nice. We have to get some social. We'll try and find somebody, another victim. <sighs> we kissed all of these guys already, so that is unfortunate. Actually, I wonder if he counts. Nice, nice. Okay, so let's refine and or organize. We want it to be an excellent quality. She's only allowed to have one child. And I'm going, I am going to cheat and make sure that it is a girl. 
because I do want to do a girl for the next gen. So, okay, why don't you clean this up since nobody else is apparently going to. When is our, oh, our debate guild bar night is tonight. Perfect, because she's feeling lonely. So that'll be perfect. 8 p.m. tonight. She is her social is low, so that will be good for her. We're going to go to these classes, knock out these classes, and we're going to go get something to eat. All right, tell Rosie you got to go. Rosie spread some juicy gossip about Hunter, her brother. I'm crying. So What? By the Barry household? What? Oh my god, uh, Forrest just had another kid. Which household? Oh, I don't know. It's that by the Barry household. I don't know. It's a little weird. Let's go to this event. And we're gonna bring our girls Autumn and Candace with us. Any guys that we could potentially... No. Alright, let's go. What's the current event? So, after much heated discussion, the Big finally settled on where to go for drinks. So, let's go here. Hey, my love, I made something delicious for you. Want to come over and taste it? Oh, he's being cute. But she doesn't find him attractive. Oh, she does seem attra as attractive. So, maybe she will end up with him. So far, she sees him as attractive, his as attractive basic looking i think her things like changed extremely attractive basic looking so you know who is this millie taylor she's cute why don't we go do a flirty introduction with her whoa <gasps> guys wow what a sim ruby just stopped what they were doing thinking for a moment and found themselves oh my god stop kenji nakayama that man has so many of the qualities that makes Ruby's heart race. This is Kenji, right? <gasps> okay. Let's talk to him. She finally has found someone that she's extremely attracted to. Which, that's crazy. Let's talk to him. Kenji is single, but we're going to talk to him and just be friendly right now. Because we're not going to... He's not going to just be one of the guys that we mess around with. It's just going to be friendly right now. Kenji's majoring in history. <gasps> just like her. History degree, romantic interest. Proceeds extremely attractive. So she finds him extremely attractive. We're going to modify him in cast really quick because he is a potential future love interest. What do we think? I think he looks pretty good. Pretty handsome, I would say. Alright, well hopefully she still finds him as... Okay, she does. Alright, where is he at, though? Because you're up here talking to other people and not him. Ooh, but him we can get... See, I want to get to know him. So, let's ask about his day. We'll conclude him in the kisses, but he might be somebody that we end up with. And then also do a respectful introduction to this guy. And we might add him into our little... Okay. Let's... Let's go talk to him. This guy could be another guy that we will have a kiss with. Oh, he left. Dang it. Alright, that's fine. Let's talk to this guy and try and get a kiss out of him. Let's keep doing a little bit of flirt. Finds her unattractive. Okay, well. No! Stop right now! Stop right now! He's over here. Forget it. <gasps> oh no, he saw her! <laughs> Alright, we gotta go. We gotta go because everyone's seeing... All of our freaking love interests are coming in here and they're seeing us. I thought he left, but he didn't. He's still right here. We could have a first kiss with him. Do we do it? Uh oh. Will he reject her? <laughs> Aww, they're cute. Okay, guys, we only have one more kiss left to get. We're gonna go home now and go to sleep. 
Okay, guys, I think that this is a good place to stop. Things are going really, really well. Um, we only need to get one more kiss in order to move along. Um, we met a sim that she finds extremely attractive, which obviously I put CC on him, but her attractive preferences change all of the time. We originally thought we were going to go with Corey over here. But she sees him as basic looking, which I think he's actually pretty cute, but so we're getting a move on. This Kenji kid could actually maybe possibly be our future husband or baby daddy. Uh, let me know what you guys think. If you guys think he should be one of them. We met him in college and then maybe we graduate and we move on in our life and we kind of just forget about him and find somebody else and then that's when we leave somebody at the altar for him or something i don't know what do we think so let me know what you guys think thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget that if you liked this video to give it a big thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification bell so you never missed when i post Thank you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.